Hello, welcome to MyLoveForums.net. This is tutorial 3, viewing the file system off the system of the Milo. Right, if we scroll down to the tools, then to settings, then network settings, and then connection info, we can see what the IP address is of the existing wireless connection that we're already connected to. Right, the IP address is the second one down. In this case, it's 192.168.1.107. Make a note of that, okay? Right, to make it easier for ourselves, if we open up a text page, I'll make it big so you can actually see it on the screen, hopefully. Change that to large. Right, do I type out? All we need is file, F I L E, then a colon, then forward slash, forward slash, then it's localhost, L O C A L. H O S T forward slash then it's Z N A N D forward slash then it's a full stop then a percentage sign um, then it's number two then a small e and then finish off with a forward slash okay now add a little trick if you double click on shift and then hold the left key down that will highlight all the things on the screen then click on FN the function in the bottom left click on C for copy that will copy that click on back do you want to save this? yeah I'll save it later on I'll save it as number one okay right now let's go up to the web browser click on input address click on it to highlight it Press FN once and then V for paste. OK. Click OK. And hopefully we should be able to see all the system settings. There we go. Starting off, I should be able to see this, I'm afraid. I'll make it a bit bigger for you on the screen. Go down to text editing. Nope. Text size. Make it large. Can you see that all? You got things like uh, Tutopia, Bin, Dev, Home, Lib, MNT for Mount, Prop, Spin Settings. So if I click on that Z N A N D, click on OK, you should recognise the screen. Document, Dropbox, Music, Picture and tools, that's the same as when you plug in the USB now all these files are read only so you can't actually change anything but for example, click on document one, it should have that one which we saved a second ago, one.txt for that file click on OK, and there we go I hope this helps you, bye bye